and welcome to vlog on day three it's actually december 4th and i didn't really vlog at all on december 3rd so i'm gonna let vlog on day three be a dorm tour so hi guys this is the layout of the apartment style dorm that i live in here at armstrong state university the community is called compass point and i live in a four bedroom two bath apartment uh this style would run you about three thousand three hundred forty dollars per semester and they also have a two bedroom one and a half bath option that runs about two hundred fifty dollars per semester or more so here i'm just going in through the front door and this is the shared living space quick overview light so yes the light bulbs are very very yellow in all of the, the fixtures but this is the shared living space we don't really use this because we hardly know each other but the couch splits apart so you can turn it into like a sectional style there's a side table there's a dining table that's supposed to have four chairs but one's being used and then it has a bookshelf over in the corner and a coffee table we have an island peninsula kind of thing a full full stove full oven full size refrigerator microwave and all of that comes standard just bring your own kitchen supplies now this is the bathroom area it's for four persons so it's a double sink two people share each bathroom the one on the right is my side and one of my roommates and we share that one it's the one that has the bathtub and on the left just has a shower then it has some shelving units both have the toilet and then there's storage underneath the sink and now to the good part my bedroom i've been living here since august and i'm finally kind of satisfied with it so here's an overview So I'm going to start in the corner. When you first walk in, you'll see my I Love Black People poster that I got while I was in Atlanta for the Spell House Homecoming. And then that hook over there is where I keep my latest jacket that I'm using for the day. I got that trash can. It's metal from Ross. I think $5. My Bath & Body Works plug-in. And then my niece's Christmas present. The rug I got from our bookstore, I think it was about $15, it's a shag rug and it's really small and I don't really like it, but we have tile floors. These are all my most frequently used sneakers, most of them are Rocher Runs and then that one pair of white Converse. This is my, on top of my dresser, so you see I have my Christmas tree with all my gold ornaments that I got the whole thing plus the lights from Dollar Tree, all for a dollar, so it's about $5. My plate of candy for friends to come by and get that. My boss um, keeps Christmas cards, so I like her handwriting, so I left that card there. Magazines for people to read when they come in. Um, sunglasses, piggy bank, two little TV my grandma got me, all that. And then my quote unquote gallery wall. So this is just a clipboard that I got for I think $2, and then I painted it with acrylic paint. A single Polaroid of me that I got a week ago. And then I print out this picture that I like from Tumblr. I painted this one with gold and black acrylic paint. And this is a collage that I made with a group on campus. What we want our future to look like with the next five years. So take that as you will. And then I painted this one and I printed out a Georgia and put it in the middle. I made this during the Joey and the Scammer phase. That's my certificate of membership from Sauce, and then that's my high school diploma. My 
my book bag is over there and I have a storage box because I'm about to go to Christmas break. Here's my desk. Move the mirror. So up here, the tray I've gotten from home, but I have a pair of shades from Forever 21, some fake glasses, a tiara, a headband, my high school graduation photo, and bobby pins, some some spare hand sanitizers for when I switch them out, a air freshener, car scenes humanities, a stapler, a Christmas present, a cup of water, the lamp was from Walmart for five dollars, and the speaker I got from Big Lots and it's a Polaroid. My laptop is Dell, it's very old, I've had it for six years, it's time for get another one. Comment down below what I should get for my next laptop because I'm really in the market for one. This drawer is where I keep all my academic things. Um, it's looking sparse because the semester is almost over. Down here is just miscellaneous things to store, a box of tissues, a flashlight, most of my makeup's down there, and batteries and medicine and all that good stuff. My step stool because I'm 5'3 and I can't get into my bed. That's, that was $7 from Dollar General. And I almost forgot that drawer is other miscellaneous things. Pens, pencils, utensils, stuff. Now on to, oh yeah, that's my bonnet. Keep it on a hook so I don't lose it. In my bed, this comes from Walmart. I believe it was 10, maybe $15. That pillow I got personalized from walmart.com. About ten dollars. The builder bear is from home, um, and the media pills from Walmart, and I think it was thirteen dollars. And one more piece of art that I made that I actually don't like, but if it's all these black and white pictures, so I don't forget what anybody looks like. And then um, the full mirror. I forgot to mention that I'm planning on adding more pictures in that section. So yeah. So the closet has mirrors on it, and. This is the hook that I keep the current bag on. There's my good quality Armstrong blanket. And here's the closet. Not very organized at all, but um, ignore the hot sauce because I like hot sauce. But um, yeah, clothes, extra storage, bags up there, old prom dress just in case something fancy happens. On the other side, this is where I hang most of my nicer tops. So anything basically that isn't a t-shirt or bottoms will go on a hanger and go in this section. And I do like to color coordinate. So back to the dresser up top is undergarment drawer, all types of stuff. And in here is rolled t-shirts. I try to color coordinate, but most of them need to be washed. And the bottom drawer is bottoms which also needs to be washed or packed away. So that about wraps it up. One last quick overview. Thank you so much for watching my fall 2017 dorm tour. I hope it's to your liking. I like my room. Be sure to come back for a vlogmas day four and don't forget to make yourself proud today.